bisa. expect me to do? Just sit back and let you make a terrible mistake? We're not arguing about this anymore. I've already made my decision. But you're making the wrong one. You have no idea how this is going to affect you. This isn't up for debate. It's too late for you to sit here and lecture me. I know you're scared. Yes. Yes. I admit it. I'm scared. Okay? Having a baby right now would be a big mistake. I have my whole life ahead of me. I'm, I'm supposed to go to college. I'm supposed to enjoy my youth. I have dreams I want to accomplish. I, I can't have a baby right now. I mean, I mean, I don't even want to be a single parent. What am I supposed to do? Hmm? Go to school all day? Work all night? Who's gonna raise my kid? You? This is clearly a big responsibility that I'm not ready for. Nor do I want. Besides, it's very early in my pregnancy and it says in here that it doesn't have a heartbeat yet, so technically it's not a life. Having an abortion is a big mistake. One that you're gonna regret. It's my life. My body, my choice. <sighs> I know this might come as a shock to you, but I was young once, just like you. I'm pregnant. I sat in a chair just like this one. In a clinic like this. But you know the world, it was so different back then. Society, it wasn't as liberal or accepting to the idea of an abortion. There was so much public shame and guilt attached to it. I couldn't tell your grandma. She would have flipped her wig and disowned me. But I felt really alone and on my own. And just like you, I, I was scared. I had the whole world ahead of me. I definitely was not ready to be a mother. But had I made that decision to abort my baby, you wouldn't be here. What made you change your mind? I prayed. God, I asked God to help me make the right decision. And then I was reminded of that Bible verse, Jeremiah 1.5. I knew you when I formed you in your mother's womb. Before you were born, I set you apart. saw you in all your beautiful imperfections. He saw you as a finished work in Christ, even before I conceived you. I wasn't ready to be a parent. But when you were born, you know, you changed my life forever. You were the best and the most beautiful thing that ever happened to me. You're, you're my daughter. But most importantly, you're a daughter of the Most High God. There's going to be difficulties, but you're never
never gonna be alone in this. Your baby deserves to live. But, but you are right about one thing, though. It's your life and your body. But before you make your choice, can I pray with you? Jasmine? God will meet you in the middle of your struggle. Invite Jesus into your heart. You have the power of prayer.